Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for June 21st of 2022, well, it is titled Analemma over Taipei. So what do we see here? Well, here we see an image of the sun or multiple images of the sun taken at different days over the course of the year, but at the same time and from the same place. So at the same time of day and from the same place, uh, same location and looking at where the sun was in the sky. And what we get to see is the changing position of the sun over the course of a year. And it forms a figure eight pattern known as an analemma. And we can see over on the far left side, we can see the winter solstice, the December, when the sun is lowest in the sky at any given time. So that would be when it is the lowest in the sky. And on the opposite side, it would be the summer or June solstice when it was when it was the highest in the sky. So again, at the same time of day, the sun will be lower or higher in the sky, depending on the time of year. Now on the days of the solstices and the equinoxes in the middle, then it was taken a multiple images of the sun over the course of the day. So you can watch the pattern of the sun as it got to that location and back to the horizon. So we can see that kind of pattern, this figure eight pattern that will form. Now you can get this from any place that you can take an image of the sun over the course of an entire year. Now if you took it every single day, then you would get a more complete figure eight pattern. Here we have just scattered images to be able to show the pattern that we do see with the sun. Now the reason for this pattern depends on two specific things. It depends on how tilted the Earth's axis is. And it also depends on how elliptical the orbit of the Earth is around our sun. And those two things combine to give us the figure eight. The tilt of the Earth's axis is what gives us the stretch along the long axis here. The more tilted, of course, the more detailed, the more stretched out it will appear. The less tilted it would be, it would be a much smaller figure. The ellipticity of the orbit affects this because it changes the speed at which the Earth orbits around our sun. So there are times that we're moving a little bit faster or a little bit slower than an average sun would be on an average day. And therefore the sun ends up either ahead or behind stretching out the loops on the top and bottom of the figure eight. So you could get an analemma of different patterns on other planets as well. And that would just depend on those two things, how tilted the orbit of the planet is and how elliptical the orbit of the planet is. So this is a signifying here for the first day of summer, which started this morning uh, when the sun reached its highest point for the longest, sending the longest time in the, in the sky for those in the northern hemisphere. And of course, the opposite for those in the southern hemisphere, this would then be the shortest day of the year, the least time the sun spent the least time in the sky. So that was our picture of the day for June 21st of 2022. It was titled Analemma over Taipei. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.